The Impact Lounge is the number one YouTube channel for fans of Impact Wrestling. Make, make a, make a, uh, a good, good lucha, lucha thing. That is just a fact of life. Hi, this is Ian Carey from SEScoops.com. This is just for both of you. When the original LAX stable uh, first formed and got going, you guys were both teenagers. Uh, I'm wondering if the original stable was uh, something you guys uh, enjoyed watching when you were uh, coming up, and uh, if that kind of plays into um, your satisfaction with the angle now. 100%. We, uh, you know, we, like, we were uh, we were saying it when we were doing the interviews for Impact. Uh, LEX has been something that we we watched since when we were kids. You know what I mean? And and the fact that there was two Latinos out there, um, not like playing a gimmick, but being them and being proud of who they are and what they represent, and uh, putting their 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 everything into what they were doing was something that we admired and respected, even as as teens and. And to see how everything played out, and to see where we are now, and, and the whole feud and everything, it's pretty. Uh, it's pretty surreal. It's a pretty uh, cool thing. Um, I never would have thought when I was, you know, 14, 15 years old that when I was watching them on TV, I never would have thought, hey, I'm going to be at uh, Slammiversary 16, uh, wrestling the original LAX and putting on one of the best matches in, in Impact history. So it was definitely a, a cool experience. I, lo- I love how highly he thinks of, of us. It's so great. <laughs> huh? But uh, I- as I said, I love how highly you think is the best match. Yeah, I love the confidence. <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> but uh, yeah, just to go off of what Santana was saying, like uh, just growing up in the game, like watching indie wrestling, uh, my background is different from Santana's as far as being a wrestling fan. So when I got into wrestling, it was like that early 2000s boom. And a Homicide was definitely one of those dudes that was just killing it on the indies, doing early Ring of Honor, up until him getting signed to TNA Impact, and just just watching his growth as a performer and just like uh, just watching that and just like, oh man, this is this is a dude where we came from and he's killing it and he's having these insane matches with these people and then putting it together with Hernandez and Hernandez is just a truck and I, I know it firsthand. He he just he's like a big gorilla, man. He just hits you and it's like, oh. And it, it, it's just awesome. And then with the mouthpiece of Conan, and it's just, it, it was pure magic. And just watching that and then being a part of it is, yeah. But uh, to go back to your question, honestly, I never thought I, I would be a part of it, uh, uh, LAX, in any way until the opportunity arrives. And now uh, we can't ask for a better position. And we just are carrying the ball, and we're going to take it to the moon. Hey, don't forget to leave a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Check out the video below for more Impact Wrestling-related content. This is the Impact Lounge.